really out of place? Well, you're not the first to feel like that. Check out this battery. They found it in Iraq in 1957, in the middle of a bunch of stuff that's 2,000 years old. Over the last few decades, archaeologists have started to find lots of objects that really don't belong where they're found. They call them UBAs, which stands for Out of Place Artifacts. This fossil spark plug called the Koso artifact is another one. Was there some kind of ancient civilization building big stone cars? And if so, where'd they get the technology? I'm sorry, that information is classified. Smile! One more time, but goofy. All right, how's this? <laughs> Got it. <laughs> This could be the last picture of my mom before she gets a record deal. Well, I'm not holding my breath. I am. <laughs> uh, nice place, Irene. I get a discount. Excuse me, we have a reservation? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm not. Dad, Dad Rats. Rats. Oh. Checking in. What, what are you doing here? Well, I, 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 I um, can't access the cover story. The board shut down. Reboot. Uh, I'm back. <laughs> Hi, guys. <laughs> I, I, I was just checking to see if you checked in because um, I was following your tour on the internet and I was here on business. And I remember I promised Fee that I would give her a copy of the beta version of my new web browser with built-ins for streaming audio and video. Uh, you did get my uh, email about this, didn't you? Oh, yeah, the email. Y you knew Tad was coming? Well, he did promise me a copy of the browser eight months ago. And I thought, well, you know, since we're both here, we could interface a little. <laughs> you know, maybe um, uh, sing a few rounds of the jingle you wrote for my company. In a world, one list startup star, or, or, or do a crossword puzzle, or, or maybe go on a date. A date? Well, you, doesn't have to be anything formal with clothes. <laughs> No, 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 of course, of course, you know, we wear clothes, but not formal clothes. Focus, focus, focus. Hey, Tad, what are you doing here? Nothing. I mean, I mean I'm talking to Fee, that's all, nothing else. <laughs> yeah, fee, five of them. Let's power browse in hypertext. Can I go, Mom? Um, sure. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Um, for you, it's a uh, rose. See? Uh, <laughs> well, it's from my garden in Utah, but I've been here a week. Um, well, it's red. Um, thank you. Oh, you're, 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 you're welcome. I'm gonna go now. Who is that? That is Tad Raxel, the world's richest computer genius. Really? That wouldn't have been my first guess. <laughs> you work here, don't you? Oh, thanks for saving my diskette back there. Thanks for the upgrade. Oh, yeah, it's a multi panel browsing environment. Let you search, chat, download, print. You really like mom, don't you? And watch a movie all at the same time. Simplicity, the wave of the future. 
But you didn't come here for a date. Who told you that? You did. You said you were here on business. Now, what type of business brings you to a little tiny town like Paradise, Virginia? What are you doing? Can't you ask me? Hmm, finally. Home of the CIA. Is that why you're here to work with the CIA? Not necessarily. Why don't they put you up in a place like this? They want to keep their project low profile. It's very hush hush. You are working for them. Must be very important. Well, I thought it would be. Then they showed me the cheese wheel. The cheese wheel? They told me they found this thing made out of beryllium alloy. Uh, they thought it might be a computer. So I took a CAT scan of the original and made a 3D model. How does it work? Well, it doesn't. The thing has no power source. Ergo, it's not a computer. It might be a piece of art. Actually, you know, it wouldn't look too bad in my foyer. Could it possibly have a battery inside? Huh? Uh, no, no, no batteries, no solar panels, no little mice running around inside generating a magnetic field. Hmm. Actually, it was a complete waste of time. The only bright spot is that Molly would be here, too. And actually, it's the only reason I agreed to come at all. But alas, my plans for a romantic interface have been shredded like yesterday's government secrets. Mr. Raxel? No, 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 no. Tad. Uh, Tad? You should use my mother. If you didn't try so hard, if you just tried to be yourself. Be myself? Um, no, <laughs> that wouldn't work. You don't really know me, Fee. I'm, I'm, I... No, no, that wouldn't work at all. Fee. Fee. Did you see the old guy in the coat check area? Old guy? Yeah. He had this, uh, this little computer thing or something, and I'd swear your face was on it. What? Yeah. Wait. Was he a little guy? White hair? Goatee? Yes. I saw him watching us in the lobby. That sounds like my contact. Is he the one who broke into our suite? You have a suite? My mom gets discounts. Wait, someone broke into our suite? Yeah, they went through all of our stuff, but they didn't take anything. That's what I came down here to tell you. He must have been shadowing me. This is outrageous. They waste a week of my time analyzing a metal cheese wheel, and now they're violating your first... No, fourth. Their whole one of your constitutional rights just because I talked to you. Did we miss something? This, this is a crime against democracy. Our tax dollars pay their salary. Cheese wheel shouldn't be a secret. It should be in a museum. Well, or possibly an art gallery. Well, anyway, anyway, anyone should be able to see it. So could we see it? Why not? You think outside the box. You're just the kind of person this project needs. And, well, you two can come along, too, because... Well, you're with her. Come on, let's go. Come in. Hi, Ned. Hey, Molly. Uh, this got mixed up with Irene's stuff. Oh, thank you. Ah. You're thinking that I should go on a date with Tad tonight. I didn't say that. Well, you didn't have to say it. You were thinking it. I wasn't thinking. I was relating. I was remembering how nervous I was the first time I ever asked Irene out on a date. I thought she was so far out of my league. And frankly, she did too. <laughs> but I grew on her. Okay, so you're saying that I should go out with Tad because he will grow on me? Well, I guess what I'm trying to say is... On behalf of guys everywhere, hey, you just never know. I'll see you later, Mom. Bye, Ned. Coffee 
coffee maker in my hotel room. I reconfigured the microprocessor so I could make copies of the magnetic strip on my security card. where they shouldn't be. Wow. Look at number three. A computer said to have been created by the ancient underwater civilization of Atlantis? Oh, this is in fact. This is fable, myth, urban legend. Yeah. Don't know what's happened to the internet. Ted, if you want to know the truth, you can't be afraid to think outside the box. All right, then. Focus, focus. Problem solved. That UPA equal, equal X. X. Let's assume this is extremely advanced technology, beyond anything even I am aware of. What makes it work? What made it move in the lab? I don't know. I was just staring at it and thinking to myself, where are you from? And it moved. Hmm. It must have read my mind. No, that's impossible. Thought control technology is only in the theoretical stages now. They could hardly have had it in the Stone Age. Hey, Ted. Phone for you. It's, uh, Mrs. P. Oh. <clears throat> Hello? Um, tonight? Here? Really? Uh, could you hold for a second, please? Sufficient. Or, or, or should I wait for you to reconfirm? Oh, okie dokie. Great. Well, I don't know who that up for you. I 
you could have a date with your mother. I, 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 I have to go get ready. I uh, hope my cologne hasn't expired. Wait, wait, Tag, we'll warm up the Ulva. Fee, forget about that thing, okay? It's over. Jack, I sent it messages with my thoughts. Well, it didn't send one back to you. how a computer works, right? The binary system. Everything's made up of ones and zeros. All right, so open and closed represents ones and zeros. Maybe. I'm done. Did you ask it how to win the lottery? I asked it where it was from. Then why did it give you numbers? That's it. What's it? Map coordinates. 34, 58, 12, let's try north. 23, 43, 27 east. you're short on RAM yourself. <laughs> yeah, although I've never seen your test scores. <clears throat> uh, did you know that if you uh, rub a spoon with a napkin, you upset its surface ions and you can make it uh, stick to your nose? Dad, Dad, why don't you um, tell me something about yourself? Like what? I don't know. Um, how about your favorite moment when you were a kid? Oh, gosh. Um, <laughs> um, I, I was in my dance workshop, and, and I found this jar filled with little metal parts. So I poured them out on the table, you know, to play with them. But as I started to look at them, I started to see a pattern, a, a logic. I could actually see in my mind how the pieces fit together. It turned out there were pieces of an antique watch. And when I put the last piece in and wound it up, it, it, it well, tick, tick, tick. <laughs> <laughs> I made it work. Wow. Your father must have been really proud. Oh, well, he was. But then he made me do it again and again in front of the neighbors. I became very nervous around people. <sighs> Well, I don't think someone as secure as you could understand. Me? Secure? Are you kidding? Right now, I'm waiting to hear about a record contract, and I, I'm so nervous that if... Ah, uh, you're convinced you won't get it? Yes. And, and you're angry at them for turning you down even though they haven't? <laughs> yeah. How did you know? I do that all the time. Hey. We do have something in common. Yeah, paranoia. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> <laughs> Molly, you have made my dream come 99 point 
46% true. Well, would you be willing to fill in the other 0.54%? How would I do that? By, um, singing a song. Just for me. <laughs> and to uh, complete this wonderful evening, I have ordered the specialty du maison, Cherry's Jubilee in the shape of Krakatoa. <laughs> you know that volcanic island that blew up in the late 1800s. Yeah. Well, uh, Tad, uh, you know, I think, uh... Is it supposed to be this? Oh, my! They just got blowing out. <laughs> another question and that old guy showed up with these two big goons in black suits and they started chasing us goons you've been chased by goons well that doesn't yeah give me i'm gonna take this back to my research facility in utah and i believe me i am going to find out what this is i don't think that's a good idea hmm? i'll take that if you don't mind uh, 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 Tad, don't give it to oh, him I, uh, yeah. Wait. Uh, I just want to know one thing. You guys really work for the government if I've been duped. What do you think? just happened here? Um, dessert, anyone? <laughs> so. Oh, 
Kitty Hammond Evans? Oh. You okay? All my photos at the Uber are gone when I got back to my room last night. Along with all my notes about the map coordinates. All of my research disks are missing, too. I am sorry. Um... I didn't take your oopa theory seriously. Obviously, somebody else did. You mean you take it seriously now? Uh, even if I did, we have no proof. Then we'll find proof. I mean, we both saw it. We know it exists. I communicated with it. I know. I know. Um, Good morning, Tad. Oh. Good morning, Molly. Heard from the record company? No. Not yet. How about I buy the record company? <laughs> then you can write your own contract. <laughs> well, thank you. Mm. And don't worry. They will call. Okay, everyone, on the bus. We got a sound check in two hours. I guess we'll never know where that Oopa thing came from. Fiona, knowing you, I'm sure you'll find it again sometime. But hey, if uh, it really reads your thoughts, maybe it'll find you. Yeah. Saturday night, don't miss an encore presentation of the Disney Channel original movie, The Cheetah Girls. Then, don't miss your one and only chance to see an exclusive alternate ending to the movie. It all starts Saturday night at 8, 7 central.